Hey guys, for today I'm going to make a LPS stage, which um, I have been requested by some of my friends who are LPS fans. And these are basic LPSs. These are my McDonald's Happy Meals tour because I don't have the original LPSs yet. So if you're asking where I got my LPSs, these are not real LPSs. So I don't think you guys should worry about that because they are really ugly looking and they look like they came from China. And for this one, I put some nail polish on because I want his eyes to be a little glittery and the eyes was ruined because sadly the paint is not very um that good so it didn't stay that long but all you need is this place like this and mine has a lot of dust for some reason so i'm just gonna take some tissue and just wipe it um all around and um but anyways this is just a little box that my aunt gave me so if you find any boxes that are like this or it's not boxes it's just, just that it has like this two sides um, my aunt, she used to work as a, um, foundation, um, like, producer and stuff, and, um, someone at the door, but, um, yeah, but this is for where you put your, um, perfumes and stuff, so, that's, um, that's what I got, so, yeah. So, you'll need this box, and you'll also need a lot of cardstock paper, which I got, um, this at a local craft store um <clears throat> which i got for quite a cheap price and really nice you'll need a hot glue gun which mine is running out so i have some extra silicone which is hot glue gun like bullets <laughs> basically i'm just messing around with that okay um you'll need a glue gun which is just gonna have to take these out because it's annoying now um you'll need also some felt or in this case i don't have that much left so i might change it but i make a theater i'm making a little theater stage so you can choose another color though because i have a lack of red and i might um use yellow for the background but yeah i have it yellow right here so I'm not be using that. Okay. And we also have some scissors. And this is very optional, but you could always have some twine or yarn. Or maybe some ribbon. But this is really optional. Like it's just that if you want to. Um by the way, this is very, like inspired by my froggy stuff, so I'm just making it like similar. So first, I take the cardstock, which actually smells really good. Um, for some reason, I don't know if they sprayed any like perfume or something on, but it smells really good. And you're just gonna sort of wrap it around your um base part on because i don't want to have that bulgari man um perfume stand thing showing so you're just going to um wrap it around and you want to bend and crease of the height and what angle and stuff so like that and you're gonna have this And then you're gonna fold it up. And then just fold it like that. Sometimes it will not be perfect. So it's okay if you don't get it as smooth as possible. And I'm really sorry for the lack of videos. <laughs> And really, it's okay if you have some excess because you can always trim that off. Um, so you're going to start from the side. Okay. This is not cooperating with me. I'm so pissed off at that. Oof. Okay. So I don't want it heating because it smells like burnt chicken. Now I'm just going to put some glue on this side right here. And then I'm going to... Put it there. Okay. 
No, I'm just gonna use my finger. You should not try my, um, the way I clean my hot glue gun. That is the dumbest way of doing it, but that's how I do it, because I just want to finish fast, and that's what all I'm, like, aiming for right now. I'm going to turn it, and then I'm going to just go all around the platform and stuff until the end, and I'll come back with you. Okay, and I'm finished with that. And as you can see, there is a lot of access, uh, access um, paper, and you just want to first take off the glue strings that is made when you drag your hot glue gun, and it became a lot. Okay, so I'm just going to move my hot glue gun aside, and you're just going to take each corner and just go as deep as you can, like that. And then you can either choose to fold it over like that, like I'm going to do, or you can just cut it off like just like so. So <laughs> I just drank like a smoothie just now. And I think you guys noticed because of the um, pausing for some reason. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just gonna fold that and glue it on. Okay, so there might be some background noise, and I apologize. And, um, so this is what I basically got. And now you can choose to cover this on top, or just paint it over. And I'm just going to add another layer on top, and I'll come back with that. Now that I have that covered... I am just going to take some felt and I'm just going to sort of drape it over like um, curtains. Instead of felt, you can also use fabric, but this is what I have available to me. So now you take the felt and you're going to put some glue on top, like so. And you want to have a lot of glue so you can stick on very nicely and. And this is what it looks like for now. And now you're going to just sort of bring this side and you're just going to fold it like you're folding a fan. And you want to glue that on the bottom and I'll come back and show you what it will look like. And this is what it looks like. And now I'm going to take the yarn that I have and you can also use twine but I'm just going to use yarn and I'm going to wrap like just have it on the top right here and keep it steady. You can always wrap it around but I'm just going to have to keep it steady right here so I'll come back with that. This is what I got and if you want to add any more details onto this then you can go ahead and just draw or just do whatever you want to this. But this is what I have for now. And I might expand it. So that I have this right here. And this is really like a good stage for my LPSs. And I don't know why I have that. Sorry. Put that back there. Um... But yeah, this is my stage, and I hope that I'll make more videos um, after my test, which is coming up tomorrow, and the day after tomorrow, so um, yeah, and after the test, I might be coming over to one of the members of... Um, of the zebra orally also known as Jamie so I'll uh, I might be going there and um, we'll do that so uh, yeah I'll see you guys later and bye